Hello everyone, in this video what I'm going to be doing is setting up a VLAN in PSSense uh, to do uh, a development network on VLAN 20. So the first thing you're going to want to do is come into your firewall here, your PFSense uh, interface. You're going to want to click on VLANs, well interfaces, assignments, and then VLANs. We're going to go ahead and add. We're going to change the parent interface to be the LAN interface. The VLAN tag is going to be 20. We're going to call it the dev, or dev VLAN. And we'll hit save. So now that we've done that, we go over to interface assignments. We're going to go ahead and uh, swap it over to the VLAN 20 available network port and click add. Now we click here on the interface itself. We need to enable it. And we're going to name it dev. And then we're going to set up an IPv4 address for it. We're going to go with 10.10.3.1. We're going to do slash 24 for a subnet mask of 255.255.255.0. And we're going to hit save. We're going to apply the changes. And our VLAN is done. So first thing you need to do is go over to services. You're going to click on your DHCP server. We're going to click on dev. We're going to enable that. And we're going to set up a range of 10.10.3.100 to 10.10.3.199 and you can do this however you want I just like to keep it kind of in the middle now we'll hit save and we're good to go so anything that is on my switch to pick up the VLAN 20 will now work and then this will feed into my ESXi box and anything that I give the VLAN 20 uh, port group to will now get the packets and the packets will be for the 10.10.3.1 uh, subnet or IP address and then it would slash walkboard for the subnet. Well, thank you guys for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.